Hey, Pan Am? So you're a V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. <laughs> Agree to help me. You'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car. You go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? One guy I gotta talk to. A corpo traveling by corp convoy. No, I don't do abductions. Besides, you'd need many more bodies and heaps of gear to take a convoy. It's just one AV. Plan Brute will take it over Jackson Plains. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. You got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Thought this is mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, only thing I can move is pizza. Maybe. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirty eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash, a chew me yours? We hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. <laughs> Fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. Straight nipped my truck and the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Want to tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Boz, hey. Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Boz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Boz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Boz? Vista Del Rey, Boz. Had no idea you drive for 6th Street. Is that not allowed? No, nothing wrong with it. They still wild about stars, stripes, and core heartland values? A strong word, wild. And I don't care. They pay well. It's simple. Give that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. So... where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so, yes. Any chance they might help us in Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Good, let's roll. Get in.
Nice ride. Lots of space. Practical. Say no more. Please. How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. How the hell did you land in this mess? I like the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue? Do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Know what? Screw Rogue. Can't see why you even care. Because I need the money. Don't let her push you around. She's not the only fixer in town. Yet you're only here because she sent you. But I'm not the one bitching about her. You don't know her. Not at all. Did she tell you she was the one to bring me and Nash together? Did she tell you it slipped her mind to mention Nash was Raffin Shiv? Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. He runs with the Raids, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm -hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams. Sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. I'd not have known that side of them. So make me laugh. A fixer of her standing knows. And Rogue probably knows we're talking about her right now. Nash and I had a role to play in her game. Her plan. That's it. Rogue's a frigid old bitch. That's the truth. Gather my guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm-hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Well, might not have needed a babysitter if you hadn't lost the merch and the car. Shut it, V. <laughs> Are you kidding? Did that beauty Thornton of yours finally bite it? She rode it to death in Old Night City. Nah, it got clipped. Shit, who dared? It doesn't matter. I'll get her back. That's why I'm here. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now it's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But... But Saul never said a thing about gear. 
Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Did you figure out your differences with Saul? When you come back? Pan Am, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. We can go. Hop in. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul. He your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised to change for the Aldecaldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Not right now, no. Could just be a matter of time, though. <laughs> okay. Were those two in the army? Scorpion Mitch? Yeah. Panzer Boys. They are on contract during the last war. Panzer Boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers. A 
Okay. We have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins, and we have little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Doubt Rocky Ridge could be any deader. Everything's down. Nothing works. Well, have you found anything? No dice. Nothing's up. All cut off. Well, we'll make it work. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Fine idea. Let's get us some power. I'll look around for access points. Great. They're likely to show up in numbers. We can't know how many. We need to outfox them, then get to my car somehow. Relax. Got a few ideas. I'll try to play a little game with them at the intersection. Hell yes. Perfect. As soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Which gear's got power? Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. Now we wait. Remember, as soon as we see them, you give us power. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. In my thorn. You see her? 
really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. I'll take the wheel. There. Couldn't wait another minute, could you? isn't she? Dreamy indeed. No surprise you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V. It's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo. You got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. And I am. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got them. Sixth Street away from Just listen to me, for fuck's sake! I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. V? All right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it, would you have done it? There's one thing I've learned in Night City. It's that sometimes revenge is not sweet. Always stand to lose more than you might gain. I don't think I'll ever play by Night City rules.
Are you ready? Let's get him. Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit cleaned. Happy? And the Sixth Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. Was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Biz while you were out chasing down a vendetta. Fuck! So, feel any better? Maybe a little. Let's get out of here. What bitter cold bitch that broke. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock.
Hey, boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sixth Street not likely to pull anything. I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Sunset Motel, what's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Should be fun. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. Hey, boss. Pan Am! How's Nash? Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. There. First class merch. Mm hmm. So, everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Raffin's wiped, Sixth Street's pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. Good day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. <coughs> Gonna puke? Hello, Noah. Hey, new biz or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Did those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. This place has seemed worse. What can I get you? Brosif. Two of them. So that package for Street. What was it? You didn't peek? Phalloperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trade in them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Well, here's to that thorn of yours. Thanks for everything, partner. Another one over here. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. The Alda Caldos. Think you'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday. 
I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? What would I become if I stayed in Night City? Could always try it out. See who you become in Night City. Except, City doesn't always play fair. Don't know if it's worth sacrificing your friends along the way. You mean Mitch? Scorpion? Come on. Sooner or later, Pan Am, the city will suck you in. You won't need to cut whatever ties you got left to the Alba Caldos. Because the city will do that for you. I guess I should think about it. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh, no. The Shiver Cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Maybe we rent just one room. Good idea. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. Okay, I won't insist. Separate beds. Got it. Noah will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few winks. Starting to feel that stress go away. I'll probably be out as soon as I hit the sack. You had better get some rest, too. This is only the beginning. That's the plan. Good night. Mm hmm. Shit! Gonna puke? <laughs> <laughs> 